New video showing SpaceX's Dragon Endurance spacecraft's re-entry from Gulfport, Mississippi. It looked like a shooting star streaking across the night sky. This was around 440 this morning, about an hour before the astronauts of NASA and SpaceX's Crew-7 mission splashed down in the Gulf. Their return wraps up a six-month trip to the International Space Station. New 6's Mark Lehman is taking us through the crew's mission and their journey home. We weren't able to see it here in Central Florida, but other parts of the country caught an incredible sight as Crew Dragon Endurance streaked across the pre-dawn sky. The astronauts on board calling this the experience of a lifetime, and it marks another step towards future missions beyond low Earth orbit. That was Crew 7 calling out to Mission Control on their return trip to Earth early this morning. Minutes later, parachutes deployed from the spacecraft while a retrieval ship watched from the Gulf of Mexico. A gorgeous reflection on the ocean, heard a really nice sonic boom, and we tracked Dragon all the way down to Splashdown. The splashdown happening off the coast of Pensacola because of weather conditions. The four members on board spent just over six months in orbit on the International Space Station. They reflected on their experience before departing on Monday. We have achieved so many diverse uh, things up here from science to technology development uh, to even a spacewalk. Crew-7's research included collecting microbial samples from the outside of the ISS and the first study of human response to different spaceflight durations. The experiments paved the way for long-duration trips to the moon through NASA's Artemis missions. There we can see Dragon Endurance now being lifted out of the water using those hydraulic lifts. Teams working to get Crew-7 out of the capsule about an hour after splashdown. They were checked out before a return trip to Houston before leaving the ISS in the hands of Crew-8 who arrived last week and expect to spend about six months in space. What an experience it must be. Mark Lehman, Getting Results, News 6.